Welcome to this special Monday edition of Stevie Solves. Actually, it's not too special. This puzzle is created by Christina Iverson and Andrea Carla Michaels. Or perhaps Andrea, Andrea. It's Monday, October 4th, 2021. And before I start, I would just want to say that today I'm grateful for Broadway musicals. I've loved Broadway musicals ever since so I went to my first one in high school. I went to see Rent. My friend waited outside the theater and got front row center tickets. And I got to, I got to join them. And I have been in love ever since. Rent is still my favorite musical of all time. And tomorrow I'm going to get to see Hamilton for the first time at ASU's Gamage Theater. And I'm super pumped about it. All right, I'm working on my streak that I've got going since June 21st, even though it doesn't say that it's been going that long, long. but I've had a couple of, a couple of missteps in terms of technology since then, but I've solved every puzzle since June 21st, so cool. Well, here we go. Head of a monastery is an abbot. Handy way of communicating. That would be get it handy as in communicating using your hands. So this is going to be ASL as in American Sign Language. Sound heard in a herd. It makes me think of ba ba. Listen. Listen, boo. Listen, bro. Huh. Dry heat bath is a sauna. Oh, listen, bub. Musical? Yoko. That would be Yoko Ono, the, the woman who famously broke up the Beatles by getting with, I think it was Paul McCartney? No, or was it Lennon? Now I think it was Lennon. I should know that. Aimed at. Targeted, because going across is gonna be Labor Day weekend. Traditional end of summer, Labor Day weekend. Alternative to Beano. I think Bino is like a gas. Okay, I think it's gas X. Oops. Um, something and crate. Margaret Atwood. I know she's the woman who wrote. She wrote uh, the Handmaid's Tale. Degrees for CEOs, they mostly have MBA degrees. Onyx and Crate, I suppose, because this is Monte Carlo going across. Accessory for a witch. Oh, Oryx and Crate? I don't know what that means, but that's Broom going across, a witch's accessory. This very instant is now. Little Piggy is a toe. This little piggy went to market. This little piggy stayed home. And this little piggy cried, wee, 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 all the way home. Come into view is to emerge. Queen of the Nile, informally. That would be Cleo, as in Cleopatra. Informally, that is. Call her Cleo. Sound from a piggy. Oink. Pigs make the oink sound. Going across, we've got corn on the cob. Serve up a whopper is to lie. Places for flowers and oysters. They both live in beds. An oyster bed, that's right. A sprinkle of salt, that would be a dash of salt. Some menthol cigarettes are cools. Corner pieces and chests, those would be the rooks, a.k.a. the castles. 
things both fighters wave. I think they're going for capes, even though they don't really wave their cape. It's more like just a drape organize as an exhibit. Um, hmm. Display co hmm. of the stars, astral. Phi Beta Kappa. This is Artie Shaw. Artie Shaw, the famous swing clarinetist. Walk nervously back and forth. When you walk back and forth nervously, you are pacing. This is going to be push the envelope going across. Uh, cape. Oh, this is curate. Word after bumper or cable car. Airport guesses are ETAs or ETDs. Push the envelope. Is dare to exceed normal limits. Lawn cutting tools are edgers. Before the due date, say, you turned something in early or you had a baby early before the due date. What screen doors usually don't do? Open in, I think. Most emails offering life insurance policies say that would be spam. Freaks out, that's panics. Going across, you got Brian Eno, who was once with Roxy Music. Brian Eno, that musician. Be over dramatic is to emote. Stray from a topic is to digress. Yeah, right, is another way of saying, I bet. Alternative to suspenders is a belt. Salvador, who painted melting watches. Salvador Dali. We try harder. Auto rental company. That would be Avis. Iago is the villain in the opera Othello. Coves and fjords are inlets. This is going to be delivery service. FedEx or DHL. Parts of I's and J's. They both have dots. Dot your I's, cross your T's. Tilts is lean. State with the words wild, wonderful, oh, West Virginia on its license plate. Frankly admit something is to own it. Recipients of a welcome sight, proverbially. Sore eyes. Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Move crabwise is to sidle. Said out loud, voiced. Like the first through fifth grades, abbreviation. For some reason, I believe that's called Oh, LM, elementary, because this is glee. Aspiring attorney's exam. Notice attorney's is, is shortened and abbreviated, so the answer is probably also abbreviated, and indeed it is. It's LSAT. Some toothpaste and hair goops are gels. This is chili, that hot dog topping. Crack and redden as lips. You got chapped lips. Basil, basil or dill is an herb. Ruffles the feathers of is irks. Setting for a couple's cruise. That would be the ark as all the animals filed in two by two. PBS is the heir of Downton Abbey. Here comes my we're number blank. 
We're number one. Me too. Oh, me to Miss Piggy. Mwah! You know, Legay was that famous bomber in World War II. And a deist is someone who believes in a non-intervening God. Oh, you believe in God, but he doesn't intervene? That's an interesting explanation of deist. I never thought of it like that or understood it like that. Scrooge's fooey. Bah! Humbug. In the past is a go. Diner sandwich is a BLT. Here comes my baby. Definitely is another way of saying yes. Bird on the Mexican flag is the eagle. Many vaccinations are shots. <laughs> So there's, let's see, Labor Day weekend, push, okay, so here comes my baby, you got labor, push, and delivery, <laughs> here comes my baby, now oh, that's funny, that's a fun theme, good job girls, I love that it's two girls that came up with that too, Christina Iverson and Andrea Carla Michaels, great job, great puzzle. My favorite clue is definitely a couple's cruise, setting for a couple's cruise, the ark. And notice how they give a little question mark. That's just to let you know. It's a code for there's something. You got to think outside the box for this one. All right. That's my favorite clue. And for the word of the day... I think it's going to be this one, sidle. Sidle is to move crabwise or to kind of, yeah, to go side to, like, to move in a sideways direction according to, like, the position of your body. That's to sidle. All right. I hope you enjoyed this puzzle. Thanks for watching. Make it a great day. Namaste.